Hi guys, Truthman from Overclocking TV and we are here with uh, Team AU. Actually, that's the first team to quit the competition because they burn all the hardware. <laughs> so first question, uh, video or mainboard do you want? V uh, motherboard. Motherboard, okay. Uh, what do you think was the most difficult part at this event controlling the mainboard? Uh, probably more, more the memory, the um, getting the, the straps right and the timings right. Um, yeah, it was... It was alright. I'd spent a bit of time before coming, so I knew exactly what it needed to do. Okay, the CPU were not been before. Um, did you spend many times like trying to get the max uh, CPU frequency, or did you spend more time on getting that stable and running? Uh, we tested max max uh, max multiplier, and then we just tried to move the B clock up and down, and that didn't move. So it was just five three. That was it. Okay, so you test first and then you stay with pretty much the same frequency all, all around? It was solid um, and stable for 11 and um, 03, 32M, everything. Okay. Uh, did you have special tricks for SuperPi 32M? <laughs> we all have special tricks. <laughs> so you had one but you don't want to tell? <laughs> no, it's, it's same, um, same as everyone. Um, was a uh, max mem and tight timings. Yeah. Good point, good point. Um, tricky question, what kind of CPU bot are you using? Uh, F1, Kingpin. Mm, very good. We heard that almost 80% of the contestants here use that. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it's getting more and more in new stuff every, yeah. no, every few months. Good, I'm going to ask your teammate for about the GPU side. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hey, Chapman. <laughs> so, what happens? I uh, had a few issues with the GPU. Uh, in pre-testing it wasn't too bad. Uh, it did face some cold rated issues with cold bugs. The main graphics card we used had a cold boot bug on a hard and a soft reset of minus 50, which created a few issues, as well as a lot of the guys here have been facing the artifacts, either with the green screen or the red screens, pretty common stuff. Uh, we were pushing the core at 1842 and the memory at 1790 I think we got up to and we tried for 1800 on the memory and I gave it a little bit more juice on the voltage and unfortunately the card died. I'm putting that down to us, uh, then we stripped down, put the new card on, unfortunately when we were setting up the driver, so everything was at stock and all we did was change the quality of the driver from uh, quality to performance, we got a red screen, dead card. So it put us out of the comp unfortunately. So it's a combination about like pushing a bit too hard and bad luck, right? Yeah, pushing a bit hard and then bad luck, definitely. Good. Uh, what's your main experience with the GTX 680 Lightning? Um, actually, overall pretty good. I like the card. Uh, I'd like to see some of the cold issues sorted out and particularly with those red and green screens. But overall, it's a nice card. Cool. Um, what do you think this current generation compared to the previous one? Uh, we are like more and more issue like the the, the red and, and green screen and uh, some driver issue and stuff like that. So do you think that it's uh, for your own opinion going from the, the the hardware itself or it's more a driver issue? I think it is driver or software or the bias to the cards. Um, I do prefer the 580 as a benching card. Mm -hmm. Um, I didn't have these kind of issues. I think NVIDIA has put a couple of things in their BIOS that's made it more complicated, particularly with the P-States. Uh, so as a bencher, the 580 is definitely the better card to use. If we can sort of sort a couple of those other issues out, the 680 could be very strong. Okay, good point. Uh, one question I will ask you both yep. is, what's your main, until now, I mean the commission is still not over, there's still 30 minutes left, what's your overall uh, impression about this event? Uh, well, my first time, so yeah, really, really good and a very well set up event, so yeah, enjoying it. Good to know. <laughs> <laughs> New Dinzo? I mean, it's not your first time, so... No, no, I've been to a few of these events. Um, I'm actually quite excited. I've been, have been, oh, sorry, I'll say that properly. I have been following it and I'm actually hoping, I'm backing Team Korea. I really want them to pull it out. I think they've benched really, really well today. Uh, they've been consistent, they're quiet, they're just doing what they should, they're not making a fuss, and their hardware's going right, and they're benching hard. So I actually hope they win. Be quite cool. They are actually still in the lead for the last at least three hours. Yeah. So um, well. it's pretty much sure that they, they, they will make it. We'll know very soon. Yep. Uh, thanks, guys, for your time.
Uh, see you tonight for the dinner and the party and, and the you know, enjoy Taiwan yeah. and everything. Good? Thank you. Thanks, guys.